Senator. Now, um, can the TGA rule out categorically that the uh, SV40 primer wasn't used in the plasmids um, that was used under the process two? So there was, as you know, there was process one and process two, uh, whereby plasmids were used to make commercial grade batches. Can you please provide uh, what the sequence of those plasmids used in process two were, please? I, I can respond to that. So oh, Senator, we've answered uh, the question about the SV40 uh, codon at numerous times before, including SQ2300-2051, SQ2300-2232 and SQ23-00232. OK, that's fine, but I haven't asked for the entire um, sequence. So not just the primer, but the entire nucleotide sequence of the plasmids that we used in process two. Could you, would you be able to provide them on notice? The, the sequence okay. of the plasmids um, are not different between process one and process two. We, we well, have actually the plasmids were not used in process sorry, one. Chair, yes. you, could we please allow the witnesses to finish the response? I have been. I am. Well, Dr Kerr. So um, we have answered that question before SQ24 000229 and SQ24 001492. Senator, I'm about to pass the call. So can I just get, take it on note? Can you take on notice, please? Can I get the entire sequence of the plasmids that we used in process two, please? We can take that on notice. Thank you. I would just highlight, Senator, we, we may not be in a position to provide um, entire sequences of substances, but we will take that on notice. But given that this is related to the safety of the vaccine, I would have thought it's very important that this question is answered. We'll take, we'll take the question on notice. <laughs>